They are largely designed to make Kenya a client state, to put Kenya on its knees so that we can keep on depending, moving around with a beggar's ball. Production in Kenya has become too expensive. So everything is going to shrink, the economy is going to collapse, and we shall begin begging all over the world. And we shall be a perfect client state for the West. So William Root, I think, is empty. This head is empty in terms of uh, what are the ex existential threats that face the black people that face Africans. He swallowed the issues of the white man, the way they are packaged. He doesn't understand uh, chronic capitalism, how it works. So he has now become an agent of the West to destroy an African state. And some of the things he does, he's doing are bordering on prison. That prisonable and maybe going down the line he might be impeached. If he doesn't change course and begin understanding what Article 1 says, that the people of Kenya are sovereign, and when they elected him, there was nowhere in his manifesto where he said that the IMF and the World Bank are going to govern Kenya when he gets into office. He promised to govern this country. But he is destroying it. Everything is crumbling in one year. It's not acceptable. So he needs to shape up or, or he might get impeached down the line. I don't think his MPs will die with him. They are going to get a point whereby he can be impeached if he doesn't change course and begin doing things that benefit this country, not, not to benefit the Western powers, not to benefit the World Bank. Right now he wants to sell the assets. These assets, some of them were put up before he was born. Now he wants to come and sell them. What will the future generations have as a state? Those who run the government in the future, what will they rely on to run this government? We have already talked of food. We are talking of transport. We are talking of uh, education. We are talking of health. If these things are sold, how, how will the future governments find out those key ingredients of a modern society? So for me, I think William Ruto is going overboard. And where we are right now, we might be facing an impeachment very soon.